おう<笑>嬉しいぜ What's up, everyone? I'm Dan, and thanks to PCube for the review code for iChu Chibi Edition on the Nintendo Switch. iChu invites players to step into the role of a producer guiding aspiring idols through their trials and tribulations on the road to stardom. Developed around the premise of managing the career paths of young, talented performers, the game combines visual novel storytelling with rhythm based gameplay. It is a world where you're not just a bystander but an integral part of the idol creation process. With a wealth of idols engaged in rhythm mechanics and a layered story, there is much to unpack. In Aichi, you take on the role of a teacher and producer at Etwa V School, an academy specifically designed to train future idols. These 32 idols in training, or Aichu, are separated into nine groups with distinct styles and music genres. Each character has their own set of aspirations and unique personality quirks, making the cast feel diverse and vibrant. Your job is to guide them as they navigate the pressures of the industry, work on their craft, and ultimately make their major debut. The story starts with Seiya Ido and his group before slowly shifting its focus to the other idols, giving players the chance to explore each character's journey and struggles. What sets Aichu apart from other games in this genre is how interactive the player role is. As a producer, you aren't simply watching events unfold, you are responsible for helping these young performers achieve their dreams. Whether it's making music, solving disputes, and, or managing stress, you are the guiding hand for these idols, giving players a real sense of immersion and responsibility. A key feature of Aichu is its combination of visual novel storytelling and rhythm gameplay. As you progress through the narrative, you'll encounter mini rhythm games that break up the dialogue heavy scenes. This helps keep the performance interactive, ensuring that players feel like part of the world rather than mere spectators. The rhythm mechanics follow a standard four lane style where you tap or press buttons in sync with the music as your favorite idols' faces appear on the screen. However, the rhythm game has its challenges. While there is a difficulty range from normal to nightmare modes, the performance of your team directly affects your score and ability to progress. Unfortunately, the gacha mechanics left over from the game's live service roots impact the rhythm game more than they should. The idols you scout from the gacha system affect your in game performance, with rarer characters offering better abilities and higher scores. While there are no microtransactions, the drop rates are still low, meaning players may spend a lot of time farming for the characters they want. This adds a layer of artificial difficulty, particularly in the higher difficulty modes, as your success becomes tied to the stats of your idol team rather than purely your skill at the rhythm game. Despite these challenges, when you finally have a well rounded team and can play through the harder tracks, the game feels incredibly satisfying. Hitting all the notes in time with the catchy original songs and putting a successful performance on is exhilarating. Visually, iChu adopts a colourful anime inspired aesthetic that's typical of idol games. The characters are designed to be charming and unique, each fitting into their respective idol groups. However, the visual novel presentation can feel rough around the edges at times. The English localization is far from polished, with the dialogue often feeling awkward and riddled with typos. This makes it difficult to fully immerse yourself in the story. Given that the original game ran for five years with monthly event stories, it seems like the developers opted for a minimal localization effort, likely under the assumption that only a small, dedicated fanbase would play this version. While it's great that the game is available in English at all, the quality of the translation leaves much to be desired. One of the standout features of iChu is the music. With over 80 original songs featuring the voices of top Japanese voice actors, the game's soundtrack is both diverse and enjoyable. Each idol group has its own musical style, allowing players to experience a wide variety of genres. Whether it's the upbeat pop songs or more dramatic ballads, there is something for everyone. The voice acting is another highlight, adding a layer of authenticity and emotion to the performances. iChu Chibi Edition is a game that will likely appeal most to the fans of the original mobile version or those who enjoy rhythm games with a heavy dose of idol simulation. The game does a great job of making you feel like you're truly involved in the idol's journey, and the rhythm gameplay is engaging when it works. However, the lingering influence of the gacha mechanics and the lackluster localization hold the game back from reaching its full potential. Ultimately, if you're looking for a fun and lighthearted rhythm game with charming characters and great music, 
iChew Chibi Edition may still be worth a try, especially if you have a soft spot for the idol genre. iChew Chibi Edition is out now on the Nintendo eShop priced at $24.99 in the UK and $29.99 in the US. Big thanks once again to PCube, thanks to you all for watching, and until next time. ありがとう。